Hi everyone, so today's video is going to be something that I find that is fun. <laughs> um, I found this set of Faber Castell connector pin box in my art supply drawer lately. And I remember I bought this like I think two, two years ago, I think about two years ago at a local uh, stationery store. Yeah, um, at that time I just, you know, <laughs> back then I, I was interested in every art supply that I can get my hands on. So yeah, I got this. I think this is like a children's playset or something because I don't think it is like any kind of artist script. But I, I mean, it's fine. Um, I'm not artist. I mean, I'm not professional artist anyway. So yeah, so today I'm going to do a fun little coloring with this um set and it actually comes with 24 colors and yeah so <laughs> i actually have i cannot even remember what is inside the box so yeah so this one comes with it put that aside and uh you have to pull this and this so uh yeah ew <laughs> there's a mixing palette on the lid so it's nice so these are the colors and oh it comes with a chinese white that's not too bad uh and this i pres i think is is a brush yeah it's a brush it's a oh it's cool and the bristles looks quite good yeah it looks quite good so later i will test with this brush and these are the colors and the colors actually look really not too bad yeah i don't think they have any like color names for this i mean it's it's fine with me anyways so oh, how do i put this back <laughs> how do i put this back uh it doesn't seem right Mm. Uh oh. How do I put this back? Okay. <laughs> um and this one, two, three, four, five, six, twelve, twenty-four. Oh, okay. It has a second layer too. <laughs> this goes to show I've never used these pins before. Yeah, the pins look quite bright and uh, yeah the pins look quite bright i'm not sure whether it is opaque pins but uh, yeah we we can find it out in a short while yeah so these are the pins and i'll be going i'll be <laughs> doing a little drawing and then i'll paint with this um, using this the brush that came with it this retractable brush it's really really cool and I don't think this set is very expensive how do I oh okay <laughs> okay so let's get started so I first um, did a quick sketch not exactly very quick but I spent about half an hour doing the sketch uh, on a watercolor paper directly and yeah I just erase as I go and the picture is nothing fancy just uh, my intention is just to like draw something cute and simple no crazy details or shadings which yeah lately I am not like a big fan of like details <laughs> I kind of started to hate details anyway yeah so 
I did a quick uh, sketch and uh, yeah, something that I find is cute and simple. And then uh, when I started using the paints, um, okay, first of all, I'm not an expert in watercolors or paints or even wet mediums, so I just you know play by ear and yeah, but um. The colors are actually quite good in my opinion. I mean, good enough for me. And but the brush, <laughs> uh, the brush is good in a in in a way or two uh, because it holds tons of water. And if you are like me, not used to watercolor, uh, the amount of water that the brush uh actually like traps, it, it will kind of like catch you off guard. Um. But other than that, it was fine. So, yeah, I actually quite like this paint and I plan to do more. So, yeah, with this one, I'm just doing a quick voiceover and a quick wash and a quick paint. <laughs> so, yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. This is some simple and cute video. And, uh, yeah, so thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.